Welcome back to another video where we break down the latest episode of Reacher, the thrilling show about a former military investigator who uncovers a sinister conspiracy involving a mysterious technology company. In this video, we will recap and explain the ending of Season 2 Episode 6, which was packed with action, drama, and twists. Be warned, this video contains spoilers, so if you haven't watched the episode yet, go do that first and then come back. What happened in this episode? The main plot of this episode focused on Reacher and his team trying to rescue Marlo Burns, the former head of security at New Age Technologies, who had gone into hiding with her daughter after discovering the truth about Project Little Wing, the secret program that was implanting chips into people's brains to control them. Reacher learned from his friend Tony Swan, who was also a security consultant at New Age, that Marlowe had evidence that could expose the company and its CEO, Langston Cole, who was behind the whole scheme. Reacher tracked down Marlowe to her friend Chad's house, where she had been staying under a false name. He convinced her to trust him and to give him the evidence, which was a flash drive containing all the data on Project Little Wing. However, as they were about to leave, they were ambushed by a team of mercenaries sent by Langston, who had also found out Marlowe's location. This led to a massive shootout that lasted for almost half of the episode, as Reacher and his team fought their way out of the house, while protecting Marlowe and her daughter. The fight scene was intense and brutal, with Reacher showing off his skills and taking out many of the attackers. He also got some help from Neely, Dixon, and Rourke, who arrived in time to provide backup. However, not everyone made it out alive. Chad, Marlowe's friend, was killed by a sniper, and Rourke, Reacher's former colleague, was shot in the chest and died in Reacher's arms. Rourke's death was especially emotional, as he had been Reacher's mentor and friend for many years, and he had sacrificed himself to save Reacher. The episode ended with Reacher and his team escaping with Marlowe and her daughter, and driving away in a van. Reacher held the flash drive in his hand knowing that it was the key to exposing Langston and stopping Project Little Wing. He also held Neely's hand, hinting at a possible romantic connection between them. The episode left us with many questions, such as, what will Reacher do with the evidence? How will Langston react to his failed attempt to kill Marlowe? And what is the deal with A.M., the mysterious assassin who has been hunting Reacher throughout the season? Who is A.M. and what is his motive? One of the biggest mysteries of the season is the identity and motive of A.M., the mysterious assassin who has been killing anyone who gets in his way of finding Reacher. In this episode, we saw him kill another police officer who tried to stop him and then steal his car. We also learned that he has a connection to Project Little Wing, as he has a chip implanted in his head, which gives him enhanced abilities and makes him immune to pain. However, we still don't know who he is, why he is after Reacher and what his endgame is. Some fans have speculated that A.M. could be a former soldier who was part of Reacher's unit, and that he blames Reacher for something that happened in the past. Others have suggested that A.M. could be a rogue agent of New Age, who is trying to stop Reacher from exposing the company. Or maybe he is just a hired gun, who is following orders from someone else. Whatever the case, we hope that the next episode will reveal more about A.M., and that we will finally see him face off with Reacher in a climactic showdown. What will happen in the next episode? The next episode of Reacher is the season finale, and we expect it to be a thrilling conclusion to the season. We hope that Reacher will be able to use the evidence from Marlowe to expose Langston and New Age, and to free the people who have been chipped by Project Little Wing. We also hope that he will be able to avenge the deaths of his friends, such as Rourke and Swan, who we suspect is still alive and being held captive by Langston. We also hope that he will be able to stop A.M. and to find out who he is and why he is after him. We also hope that the finale will wrap up some of the loose ends and unanswered questions that have been left throughout the season, such as, what is the significance of the number 650, which has been appearing everywhere? What is the origin and purpose of Project Little Wing? and who else is involved in it? And what will happen to Reacher and Neely, and will they end up together or go their separate ways? We can't wait to find out the answers to these questions, and to see how the season ends. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos on Reacher and other shows. See you next time.